Hi, fifth graders, and welcome to our remote fifth grade celebration. This wasn't exactly how I envisioned your end of the school year would be. I'm sure, I'm sure it's the same for all of you as well, but I just wanted to take a minute to congratulate you all. I've known many of you since you started with us in kindergarten. You're our last class to have been in kindergarten here at Sandown North. And it's been a pleasure to watch you grow socially, academically into wonderful, caring people. One of the things that's unique about your class is for some reason we had a lot of kids move in last year and this year into your grade level. Typically we have kids moving in at the younger grade levels. They must have heard what a great crew you were. And what I noticed is how welcoming you were to all of these people and how quickly they became part of our school community. For many of these new students, it's hard to imagine that they weren't here with us all since kindergarten. And that says a lot about how welcoming you are as a group. It's been a difficult year with the loss of our classmate, Josh, and of course ending our school year this way. But I am so confident that you're all gonna be doing wonderful things. I'm excited to see and hear about the great things you do and I hope that you'll come back and visit. So enjoy the rest of this celebration. We have some people who are gonna share some things and, and some surprises. And I thank you all and wish you all the best. Good morning, students and parents. Although this is not how we anticipated ending the year, we are glad that you could join us to celebrate the class and the completion of fifth grade. Each and every one of you has contributed to our fifth grade community. Despite the challenges of losing a friend, we have seen this class come together and show their love and support for one another. Even though we are not ending this year in the traditional way, we are proud of how you have taken this time to discover new learning. We've all seen examples of how our students have learned outside the classroom. Some of you have become accomplished chefs, creating exquisite desserts and family dinners. And some of you have explored architecture by building nets and tree houses. And some of you have developed agricultural skills by raising chickens and planting gardens. Others have used this time to challenge yourselves with hobbies and new interests. You have proven that learning does not only take place in a classroom, and we hope you'll take what you've learned during this unique time and use it as you move forward on life's journey. We've been privileged to have the opportunity to be your teachers, and we will miss you. Hello, fifth grade students. I am Linda Mensis, and I'm the owner of Playmates Learning Center here in Sandown. And every year at this time, I award citizenship awards to one student in each fifth grade class at Sandown North. This year, the recipients are from Mrs. McGee's class, Elia Gitterman, from Mrs. Polito's class, Julia Johnson, and from Ms. Worthen's class, Cole Dolloff. What is a good citizenship award for? It's for a good student who is always willing to put the needs of the class before their own needs. This student is respectful of all school staff and willing to help whenever possible, is courteous and polite. The student does not necessarily need to be at the top of the class academically, but is willing to work hard to improve his or her level of knowledge. This is a student who makes a positive impact in the classroom and in the school as a whole. In addition to getting these awards, the students will each receive a $100 cash in an envelope, which they will receive soon. And their name is engraved on this plaque, which is hung at the entrance to Sandown North and will be there very soon. And if you don't get to see it this year, then you'll be able to come back perhaps in the fall and see that it is still there. We have had many students in the past receive this award, and I'm so glad that these students are receiving it this year. Congratulations. I wish you all continued success, have a great summer, and good luck in your moving up to sixth grade at Sandown and at the Timberland Regional Middle School. Have a great day, thank you. Congratulations to Julia, Cole, and Elia 
on receiving the Citizenship Award. That's really special. I would also like to thank Mrs. Mensis, who every year has this, uh, gives this award to our fifth grade students. It's very special, as is the plaque. If we were all together today, you would be receiving your certificates of completion. Instead, what we'll be doing is sending them to you along with your yearbooks. You'll be able to pick up your yearbook, certificates, and t-shirts. So that'll be later in June. We'll make sure to get that information to you so you know when to stop by and, and pick those things up. And finally, I would like to, before we watch the exciting slideshow presentation, I would like to do one last presentation. There's an additional certificate that three fifth graders will be receiving, and this is in regards to attendance. Sam Cooper and Trevor Gomez have perfect attendance for this school year, so they will be getting their certificate for that. And Nicholas Vacaraza has perfect attendance all through his school years since first grade here at Sandown North. So that is really amazing, and I'd like to congratulate him on that. It's quite a feat. So now I'm excited for you to watch this amazing slideshow, and a big thank you to Mrs. Bruce, who always does such a fabulous job putting it together. Enjoy. Enjoy. 